Cyrus Mistry must be heaving a sigh of relief. With pressure mounting from the UK government, the Tatars have finally struck a deal to sell their Skunthorp unit, one of the leading long steel product manufacturers in the UK. And the buyer is Graybull Capital, a British investment firm which specialises in turning around distressed assets. Although the nitty-gritty of the deal is not yet out, Graybull has agreed to pump in nearly 400 million British pounds into the loss-making unit, which has been hit hard by the prolonged global slowdown and the surge in Chinese imports. The Scunthorpe unit employs around 4,800 people and has a capacity of 4.5 million tonnes, accounting for a fourth of Tata Steel Europe's capacity. Graybull expects the deal to be completed in eight weeks' time. And the unions are quite a beat. Well, we welcome it as a positive development that will um, secure the future of the, the long products business and steel making at, at Scunthorpe. So, yes, we're, we're positive about the development today. The British government has come under intense pressure to ensure that the sale process of the Tata Group's UK operations does not result in mass job cuts. In fact, the UK business secretary flew down to Mumbai last week for discussions with Tata Group chairman Cyrus Mistry on ways to save the UK plants from a possible shutdown. Analysts say Monday's deal is a win-win for all. When we look at this particular transaction, it is, uh, it is credit positive for Tata Steel. As you know, the long products business uh, you know, uh, is, uh, is, is, was the... Uh, I think it will give them a good head start, uh, you know, with this with this particular transaction. Uh, and uh, of course, we need to see how the sale of the uh, you know balance UK operations proceed. However, some questions remain. For one, there is no clarity on the kind of money Grey Bull is paying, or the UK funds turnaround plan for the bleeding plant. No word either on the 15 billion pound pension liability and who will foot the bill. But with the Tatas managing to strike the deal for the long products business, there is optimism that Tata Steel's UK exit may go through without much hiccups. Ashwin Mohan, ET Now, Mumbai. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash ET Now and don't forget to click the like button. You can also follow us on Twitter at ET Now Live. To stay updated with all our programming, hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel by logging on to youtube.com slash user slash ET Now.